Hey everyone, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the PyQt5 package using the pep install method. The first thing we need to do is we need to open our command line. And here, uh, since I'm using a virtual environment, so I'm actually going to uh, activate my uh, virtual environment. You don't have to do this, uh, it's optional, but I would highly recommend that if you ever worked with virtual environment before, and this is probably the, the best way to do it so you don't interfere with uh, your other installation. So here I'm going to activate uh, my private environment. So PyQt5 activate, and this is where I install my uh, virtual environment. Oops, uh, tutorial of oh, PyQt5 and scripts and activate. Okay, and so, but anyway, and if you do a pipe uh, list, and right now these are all my package installed in my virtual environment instance. And the command is really easy. So all you need to do is just do pip install pyqt5. And this will basically grab the package and download all the files and install onto the scripts. And so here I'm in my environment, but for you, you'll, you'll probably be in the C drive. And oh, it should be in lib in the lib uh, folder, and under the lib folder should be a site dash package. This is where all your install pack is going to be uh, stored. And now the pack is installed. Now we need to do uh, one more installation. So we need to download the the designer. And so to download the designer, so you want to do this the same thing. Inst um, oops, pip install and pyqt5 and dash tools oops uh, pipe install pyqt5 uh, ptqt and dash tools all right now it's going to collect in the, the files and let's wait a little bit all right now we're finished um, so if you want to launch the, the PyQt5 designer, all you need to do is you want to go to the, the, the site package folder, which I just show you here. And if, uh, if you are not using a virtual environment, so it will be under your C drive, uh, your Python folder and script. Uh, let me show you. So you want to go to the, uh, your Python folder and you want to go to the lib folder and look for site packages. And under there, you should see a uh, PyQt underscore tools. In here, look for uh, uh, ex uh, execution file. So here, let me sort this by type. And where's my execution file? Oh, it's right, right here. So it's called designer.exe. And double click to launch the, uh, the designer. And here's our uh, portable designer. So the nice thing is you don't have to install the designer uh, in your computer. So you can just launch the, the designer uh, directly. And close this. And now uh, if I uh, launch my Python software. And here if I want to import the uh, PyQt file package. Oops, I can just do import uh, PyQt. Oops. Import PyQt file, and let's say I want to import the widgets. Uh, Qt widgets. In here, uh, I'm able to successfully import the PyQt file uh, module. All right, so this is basically everything I want to show you in this video. And recently, I have been really enjoying uh, building application using the PyQt file. Uh, package and I'll be creating more tutorials based on the PyQt5 uh, in the future. So stay tuned. All right, see you guys later. Bye.